For my German uh, book project, I tested XML import in PTUI. First, we will see the standard process without XML import. The pictures were made with drone pan. Two Zenit pictures, one Nadia picture, and as we can see, the program is unable to stitch the pictures together. We have holes in the lake, and we have no Zenit pictures in the sky. That's also typical in other stitching programs, they work uh, the same way. So we will redo it, the, the process, we load all the images. And now we load the Paper Wizard XML import. I made this XML file with the XML creator. And now we stitch the pictures together. As we can see, we have full size 360, 180 degree panorama. So the process is perfectly working with PT going. And for the next program, I test the ICE from Microsoft. There is a structured import for the images. We can tell the program how the pictures work together. You can choose this here. The problem is we cannot use the Nadir and the Zenit images. We have to delete them. And now we can proceed and stitch the, the image. So structured import helps the stitching program always uh, in lakes and sky uh, regions to stitch together the, the images. The image compose editor from Microsoft has an autofill function. The result will be a rectangle image. Now we can export it. For auto panel, I already showed you the XML import. I will just repeat it here with the same images, so we can compare the result. First, without a paper wizard XML import, we have the same result: a hole in the lake and the sky is not stitched together. So I will do it again with the paper wizard import. First, we choose the XML file, then the images, and we have a preview of the alignment of the images, and now we can proceed. Result is the same as in PTGUI, we have no hole in the lake and the sky is fixed. I will repeat the process with other images. That's the Inspire panorama with gimbal yawing and the first draw is made with drone blocks. So it will not be possible to stitch them together without a XML script. We have no uh, plus 30 degree line and no sky on this image. And even uh, in the lake there is a mistake. So we will do it again. This time we choose the XML file, paper wizard import. Then we proceed the alignment of the images. And we can see no mistakes in the river and also the sky is perfect. I explained this picture in a video before with the drone pan and the drone blocks mission and we will do it here in Autopana Giga to see the same result without XML import not possible to stitch together the images the whole sky row is uh, full of mistakes now we will do the same this time with the XML import The advantage of Autopano is the preview of the alignment of the images, as we see it here.
the result is a perfect image. We have still some small holes in the sky, but that's easily fixed in Photoshop or Photoshop Elements. So we can say that the XML Creator works for both, for Autopano and for PT GUI. In the XML Creator you can simulate the stitching, also the overlapping for the different drones. Important to know, uh, Phantom 4 is like the Phantom 3, same settings. It's only a difference for Phantom 4 Pro, there's a new camera. You can find all the DJI drones in the menu. You can always preview the XML file, save it. We can use uh, Nadia or Senet pictures or not, so you can recreate the file, also the simulation, and you can always see the overlapping of the images.